in front of you know, after you know, reading an idea press articles. Okay. Right? In that scenario, I guess, you no, know, the system is relatively idle, right? So, because users are not really doing anything. However, even in that, even in that case, there's a tons of, you know, background traffic which keep, you know, bombarding your system in order to maintain network connectivity, to support system, uh, service discovery, and so on, mm -hmm. right? So, as you can see on the, on the left screen, Right. right. Every time a new pack arrives, you know, and hit the hit the system, it basically will light up the whole house. Right. 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 Platform and, powers up. Yeah, and sometimes take a take some time to turn off the lights. <laughs> so obviously you're gonna you know, consume a little bit of energy here. Mm -hmm. And on the right hand side, you know, with our spring metal technology, mm -hmm. right, and we actually analyze the traffic, right, in order to identify the most important packet. And you're analyzing it out of the net? Not we the actually process. Yeah, we are analyzing that in, in the NIC, okay. and we, we can remove all the unnecessary ones which are either not destined to me or can be deferred for you know, a later process, for example. By doing that, as you can see in the middle, right, we can dramatically reduce the platform activities, hence you know, save, save a lot of you know, CPU power. And, and you mentioned the second example. Yes, let me show you the second one. Okay. So let me get started. There we go. So the second one is for uh, for active, right? Where a user accessing content you know, in the cloud by downloading, streaming, audio, video, image, or any other type of traffic, right? So uh, so in that case, our Spring Metal technology is actually proactively managing the network flow in order to minimize the interruption to the CPU. Right. So I mean, give me a sense of how much power. Spring Meadow technology. Okay, so let me let me show you. So first of all, as you can see, you no, know, you no, know, we can download the same set of files in the same amount of time. So basically, there's no impact on performance, as you can see from from both yeah, sides. Yeah, they look right in sync to me. And in terms of a very good question about how much power we can save, as you can see from the middle screen, actually we can save a, about half of the CPU power. Wow, half of the CPU yes. power. Yeah. Wow, that's amazing. That is amazing. So, um, you know, it's clear this has obvious benefits for, um, for ultrabooks, but it might even be more beneficial than uh, in phones and tablets where you don't have as much battery. Absolutely, like, you're totally right. Yes, yeah, those devices can have a smaller battery, hence this technology will be even more crucial for that kind of devices. Okay, so, um, you know, with, with all this technology and you know, all these advancements, and it, you know, how soon do you think we're gonna, you know, we're gonna see this in, uh, in the market? Well, it's you no know, still a prototype, but it's getting better every day. So, you no, know, stay tuned. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll wait. Hey, thanks for showing it to us. Thank you, Charlie. Time the spring meadow.